So I'm going to set you off for 10 minutes. Graham Sage is a 29-year-old teacher with severe hearing loss. Helping him keep a close eye on the class, Jovi, the hearing dog. When Graham's timer goes off to signal the end of a class exercise, Jovi is trained to take him to the source of the noise. At home he does a lot more work, cooking alarms, uh, dishwasher alarms, washing machine, telephone, doorbell. Uh, my wife can send him to come and get me if she's upstairs or vice versa, I'm upstairs and she's downstairs. So he comes to school for a bit of a rest, mainly. <laughs> is, that, is that why he's lying yeah. down most of the time? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a bit of a relax, yeah. And the children love having Jovi around. Okay, you can see on this one. It just feels really nice when it's just like you have a dog in the classroom and it's a different experience whereas I like stroking him, he's a nice Nice dog, he's well behaved. Having the boys experience being with somebody who's deaf has been a huge learning for them. Um, but also it's just, it's really nice to have a dog around and there's a lot of mental health benefits to having a dog around the classroom as well. Hearing dogs take 18 months to train from puppies and cost 40,000 pounds over the course of their 11 year working lives. Uh, they also provide a lot of emotional support, companionship, and love, which is particularly important because a lot of uh, people who have hearing loss can find it very isolating. Now, as well as helping out at school and at home, Jovi's also trained to act in an emergency. If he hears an alarm sound go off, he'll lie down on the floor, which will let Graham know that something serious is going on. Won't you? Yes, you will. Graham had to wait three years for Jovi, but now they're inseparable, and together they make a class act. Nick Wallace, Five News, Molesford School in Oxfordshire.